My face looks absolutely dreadful tonight, but I don't care. Um, I wanted to film this really quick video about something that I have um, come up with to mount my camera onto the ring light. Now, the ring light that I bought um, has a hot, cold shoe mount and the inside of the ring light um, looks like that. And uh, they are usually tiny little parts that you can buy how you install a, a quarter of an inch tripod screw on top of a cold shoe mount to install something else on it be it a monitor or or a microphone or something that you want to install on there um but it wasn't very secure these devices come with two metal discs um that screw on but because everything's metal there is not a lot of give and and it was always wiggly and it was a pain to take off because you had to literally um hold the camera and then try to get in there with your finger it's just it was a mess I, I was looking for something else i was looking for a a archer swiss quick release plate and um so i thought i'm going to take a quick release clamp from a different tripod that i have and use it but it's different there the screws on these things are are completely different and and you cannot it's just there's no way to mount it to that hot shoe cold shoe cold shoe mount so what i what i did i looked for a archer swiss clamp that didn't have a large tripod screw in it but it just had a simple quarter of an inch opening um a thread in there and i found one on on amazon i'm i'm putting the link below and and and, and i and i ordered it then i had to basically trim take the take the screws off the um the cold shoe adapter and trim it trim the screws so that it would fit just with the camera onto the um onto the cold shoe i basically had to install that cold shoe adapter and then screw that clamp on it in place mark it with a with a marker i have i have a a little sharpie that is a bronze or silver something that writes on dark mark this and then cut it off with a saw and uh, it was very rough so i actually used a glass nail file to smooth it out because i don't want it to scratch the bottom of my camera plate i my camera has a, a constantly installed plate underneath it um so once that was in place i marked it and i cut it off with a metal saw i i smoothed it out and now i can install the whole thing onto the ring light and i have a nice quick release clamp on there now that doesn't use up a lot of room it's not it's not a it's not a a ball point a ball head because then my camera won't fit in that small inside of the ring light anymore it's very very flat and it will sit just right it's a perfect solution for my little problem and uh i know i have to make guy on my way around it because both my OCD little things bother me and it has to work just right, but it worked. I'm really happy with it now. I can't take my camera in and out, in and out because I use it all the time. It's not a constantly mount video rig. I'm just using my camera for these videos every once in a while, but the rest of the time I use my camera like a regular camera. So I needed a, an option to get that camera on and off that light setup real quick. 
So I'm glad I found it. I just thought I'd share it with you if, if you're interested at all in how to make Giver your cameras to do different things. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed watching this and um, I'm looking forward to seeing you at my next video. Have a good one. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time.